Today in this video we will talk about two theories with the help of which you can predict the gender of your baby by using the early scan. First of all we will talk about the Ramsey theory. So if you went to the doctor for your first ultrasound after pregnancy then at early year age at 6 to 8 weeks by using the Ramsey theory you can predict the gender of your baby. The Ramsey theory claims that you can predict a baby's sex as early as 6 weeks into pregnancy by using images from an ultrasound. According to the theory, the placement of your developing placenta can reveal your baby's sex. Dr. Sam Ramsey conducted an extensive and controlled study over 5,000 pregnant women. He discovered that using the location or the direction of chorionic villi that are the future placenta is an accurate marker in determining the sex of a baby. Scientifically, it relates to a natural polarization in which male embryos have a proven pattern of being magnetized toward the right side of the uterus and females are drawn toward the left side. If your placenta is forming on the right side of your uterus, the baby is most likely a boy. And if your placenta is forming on the left side of your uterus, the baby is most likely a girl. So the Ramsey theory says that the location of placenta corresponds with the baby's sex. Right for a boy, left for a girl, 97% of the time. Watch your ultrasound report and tell me, is it true in your case? Now we will talk about the numb theory. The numb theory is based on the hypothesis that you can predict the sex of your baby based on the angle of the genital tubercle. This genital tubercle is also called the numb. Mean this part of the body of your baby will ultimately develop into the male sex organ or the female sex organ. This genital tubercle becomes visible after the 12 weeks. So in order to know the gender of your baby, you must have a scan after 12 weeks of gestation. In order to know the gender of your baby by numb theory, first take an ultrasound picture of your baby in which the numb is clearly visualized. Then draw a line along the longitudinal axis of the numb and draw a line along the longitudinal axis of the spine. And see the relationship between them. If they are parallel to each other or horizontal to each other or if they are making an angle under 30 degree mean if they are very close to each other it means that you are going to have a baby girl. Now this is another image. Here you can see the numb. If I draw a line along the longitudinal axis of the numb and if I draw a line along the longitudinal axis of the spine, we can see that they are not horizontal or parallel to each other. In fact, the numb is pointing towards the spine. Or you can say that if numb is pointing towards the spine, it means that you are going to have a baby boy. Or if the long axis of the numb and the long axis of the spine is making an angle of 30 degree or more it means that you are going to have a baby boy so in a nutshell if a numb or a genital tubercle is parallel to the spine you are going to have a baby girl if the numb is pointing towards the spine it means you are going to have a baby boy the numb theory currently stands at more than 90 percent in my practice, when I applied this theory on ultrasound images, it was more than 80% accurate and the 20% false results were due to the fact that the ultrasound images were not clear. They were not showing the entire numb. Some scans were taken before 12 weeks. So, its accuracy depends upon the following conditions. You must get a scan after 12 weeks. The ultrasound image should be clear. It must be taken by an expert and that image should reveal the entire numb. Using the Ramsey theory or numb theory to predict the gender of your baby is just a fun game to play. It is not a reliable way. 
in order to know the gender of your baby you must use the reliable ways as i have told in my previous video that you can use ultrasound method to know the gender of your baby either you have a baby girl or a boy wishing you all the blessings a new baby brings thanks for watching the video